Welcome back to the channel everyone. My name is Golden Gates and today we are going to be talking about how Ralph Smart is in fact the devil. Ralph O. Krafu Smart better known by his YouTube channel Ralph Smart or Infinite Waters Diving Deep. A British psychologist, life coach, author, and YouTuber. He has over 1.6 million subscribers and over 223 million total views. All we have to do is go to his YouTube channel and look at his video thumbnails. We are not going to watch any of his videos or dive deep like he says. I don't want to taint myself or you with his sins and dangerous psychology. Now that we're on his YouTube channel, you could just clearly see that he is just spreading his message of blasphemy all throughout his thumbnails, who knows what's going on in his videos. But we can clearly see, even in his latest video, The COVID Prophecy, where he's wearing a very stylish shirt, but he's holding his arms in an X and he's outside in nature. You know who else is outside in nature? A bunch of savages and a bunch of hippies too. But the X is the most important because that means he's triple X rated, which is unacceptable. And then he's got messages to highly sensitive people and then the next one, he's got a savage in his thumbnail. And then, oh, and then he's entrancing his audience, just m manipulating his audience, spreading his message of whatever he wants. And then his next video, it's like they go in order. It's like perfectly in order. It's a trap. He's setting up a trap for you setting up your spiritual awakening trap and look there's the savage again don't wait just sell your soul that's what he's saying it has to be oh oh this next thumbnail just confirms it this is indisputable evidence that ralph smart has sold his soul i lost it all my life i was broke alone depressed and lost he clearly sold his soul, but now he's not broke and alone and lost because he's with the devil. And then he's manipulating his audience again. He's doing a, a samba, whatever that is. The dancing is, uh, it's uh, this is really draining me right now. Sending more messages out in nature, probably still with the savages and the hippies. How to open your third eye. That sounds very dangerous. You don't, why would you open your third eye? It's perfectly closed. How to attract specific type of person. That's, that's unreal. That's not real. And he's apologizing to you in his next one. Look at him. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. All right, I can't continue, but you can clearly see he's spreading his message and he's clearly working with the devil to uh, manipulate his audience it's just terrifying i need okay so this is actually how some people are in today's society they take what they don't understand and they deem it as stupid okay and then in religion they take what their religion deems as blasphemous and they categorize that as ungodly or works of the devil now, I'm not here to slander anyone's religion or faith. This is just my objective observation. Now, with this video, I would like to build a bridge of understanding and bring us all a little bit closer, even though we have different ideas and different faiths. Now, I feel that people become so radicalized, not just in religion, but just in certain mindsets that leave us very closed minded simply because we've been pushed into a corner after childhood traumas, poor parenting, or just no parents at all, which leaves a huge void within us. So with religion, 
that void becomes filled with the love and comfort with the teachings of the Bible, which then exponentially increases one's faith and then becomes the forefront of one's being, which leads to a closed minded mindset. On the other end of the spectrum, we have the people that don't find religion and they turn to drugs and alcohol to fill this void but they just end up numbing themselves, destroying their nervous system, and then that becomes their forefront of their being. Now on the religious spectrum, we have people who believe that their God is the only God and the most almighty, and that separates us from other religions, even though they have the same teachings and same wisdom. Now on the other side of the spectrum, we have the narcissistic and nihilistic people who are just completely numb of any feeling, don't care about anything or anyone. So this begs the question, why and how is this happening? We should not be condemning other religions openly, and we should not be condemning ourselves privately and disre disregard any other source of healing. Which brings me to my conclusion. Ralph Smart and many others like him, including myself, are simply messengers. We can only show you the doors. It is up to you to walk through them. At the end of every day, we are more similar than we are different. We all work hard. We all study hard. We have loved ones who we care for and wish the best for. We're all fighting battles that we don't speak about. Let's make things even simpler. We all eat. We all sleep. We all drink water. So let's not make things any harder. Because <laughs> at the end of the day, we're all mortal. And we share this gorgeous planet together. Go to any other planet? Mm-mm. They ain't got nothing on this one. With that said, I wish you guys a beautiful night, a beautiful day. Thank you to Ralph Smart and all the other content creators out there doing, doing a little samba. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.